Hi, Renee here from OneFabulousLife.com. The Law of Attraction is a pretty powerful force out there in the universe. It's hard to explain exactly how it works. Some people have figured out some tools and some tips and some tricks to make it work in your favor, but ultimately what the Law of Attraction is, is it's out there to attract more of what you want into your life. So putting out the intentions that you want to get back the things that you desire. Now, the Law of Attraction is really great and all, and you really have to believe in it for it to work. But you don't only have to believe in it. It is completely useless if you don't actually know why you believe in it and why you're using it. You've really got to believe that what you're trying to attract in your life is yours, and it's yours already. And to believe that something is yours already it's really helpful, not just helpful, it is necessary to know why it's yours. To really be connected with that driving force that is all-consuming, that is the reason you're going after whatever it is that you're trying to attract in your life. Your why will make you cry. Your why will make your heart swell up. Your why will keep you going when you feel like giving up. It'll keep you motivated and keep moving forward on those times when life just seems to be knocking you down time and time again. Now I'm going to tell you a little story of how I figured out my why. You know, I always wanted to sort of branch off on my own, have my own business, and let my creativity sort of run amok in my career. But I didn't really know why I wanted it. And up until a few years ago, I didn't even know that Knowing why was so important. I just thought, what am I going to do and how am I going to do it? Well, the answers never came to me because I wasn't connected with the source. I wasn't connected with the reason behind what I wanted. Until one day, I was on a vacation with my family and I was sitting out on the balcony overlooking this beautiful ocean while my little baby boy slept in this huge gigantic bed right behind me. I could see him out of the corner of my eye when I turned around like this. Now he was under three and he was sleeping so peacefully and I was really sitting there reading this book that I had been dying to crack open for a few months and I finally got the opportunity to. And I read the chapter on finding your why. The author Carrie Wilkerson asked a poignant question that I never I'd never been asked in that particular way. And she said, what's your why? I thought, my why? And as I read more, I started to learn about what, my why, what a why was and why it was so important. And I really connected with it like, bam, all of a sudden I got it. I understood what she meant and I understood the pieces of the puzzle that had been missing in my life in order to propel things forward. And as I read this chapter in the book, The Barefoot Executive, by the way, I figured out my why. And I looked back at him <laughs> as he slept in the bed behind me. This little beautiful soul curled up so peacefully. He was the reason I had to do this. He was the reason now was the time. I always wanted to be the kind of mom who led by example. And I want my child to have a life of freedom, to have a life that he chooses to live however he wants to live. And I want to give him the tools and lead by example and give that to him, give him that opportunity. But I hadn't been doing it. Up until then, I'd been working a job that I didn't like. I had been overworked, stressed out. I had a lot of stuff piling up in my life that just made me completely miserable. But sitting there on the balcony, reading this amazing book, answering that question, what is your why? My little boy sleeping in the bed behind me, and the real kicker was I had my baby girl in my belly at the time too. So I really felt a connection, I felt a determination that I had never before in my life felt. It was like, aha, this big moment just presented itself in front of me and my reason for getting off my ass, for working my butt off, and for taking a chance on myself finally presented itself. 
but I had to take initiative to figure out what it was. The universe wasn't just going to plop it into my lap, even though I had been using the law of attraction for years. There was one piece fundamentally missing that I wasn't doing, and that was connecting with the purpose of why I wanted to do this. And once I had my why, my little boy and my unborn baby girl, holy smokes, I, it, my career took off from there. I put a plan in action, started to move forward, and lo and behold, here I am today doing what I love and hopefully adding some value to you so that you can do the same. Because there is nothing more liberating in the whole world than connecting with your true purpose for living your own truth. It is, it is just, it's amazing. So I'll leave you with this. Figure out your why. Ask yourself some questions. Take some time to yourself. Shut the world out for half an hour, an hour, 15 minutes, whatever. Close your eyes and connect with that thing inside of you that drives you. That reason that you must make these changes. That reason that will burn and die inside of you if you don't actually feel it. So do that. Take the time. You owe it to yourself and you owe it to your why. So thank you very much for watching my video and I hope you do the exercise today. So click the link below. You'll find even more ways of figuring out your why. If you need a little bit of help, visit our website, onefabulouslife.com. Live fabulous. Be fabulous. Click the link below. She's cuckoo.